Good morning. It's Ron from East Marsh Acres, and uh, I'm going to be documenting the build, uh, digging of trenches uh, for services to the tiny house. Uh, so we started earlier this morning. I was doing some hand digging, hence my sweating, etc. Um, so this is the original power pole that we have standing out in front of the house, and uh, that's remaining. And what we're do going to do is connect another cable, so it'll be something similar to this, a little heavier maybe. Um, it's connecting into the box and going down into the ground, so it needs to be uh, buried two feet. And so it's going here. Around the wellhead. And then straight down the property line. So eventually we'll end up back there where we'll put a post. Um, I'll continue to document what we're doing uh, as we're going along. <coughs> <coughs> so I have a good idea of what uh, what's happening and uh, keep you updated. All right, talk to you soon. Okay, so uh, here's the progress of the trench, this trench anyways. So we went two feet down all the way to the end of the pad where we put the trailer and then we've stuck a post into the ground here and on that post we'll put the connection for the uh, power and uh, the internet um, so that it can stay there and we are now working Albie stay away now working on the trench for water and that has to come from the house so we've built dug trench starting at the top and then this has all been filled in with sand um, so we need to be very really careful because it will uh, collapse easily uh, which is why we've got the big old pipe there that will stick in the ground and we will put the uh, water pipe through it later. So Ron, what Ron's doing right now is working on this end. Yeah, if you can come a little bit that way because it's on that side of the door between the door and the uh, wheels. The actual connection is between the door and the wheels, so it's under here. So can you go a little bit that way? Just to uh, bring you up to date as to what we've done. So uh, we dug the trench for, for water all the way to the trailer here and a uh, piece of big O is uh, in uh, the trench. So if the trench fills in and collapses then uh, that'll be fine because uh, we've got the pipe that we can actually uh, put the pipe through and uh, it will uh, allow us to uh, get the water pipe in. Anyways, um, so that work is done and the work over here is done and I think Ron is just putting his beast back on the float behind his dump truck and he's getting out of here to work on another job and somewhere along the line I lost a shovel. Where I put it, I don't know, but I shall find it. Oh, there it is, over there, behind the post.
So Ryan's just picking up the other bucket and putting his machine onto the float. Oh yeah, okay. Another job done.